Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to do this bomb glam look. So if you like it, please subscribe and like this video and please stay tuned. Thank you. Patience could have done as well because I could tell. So first we're going to start on my brows. Um, I'm using my Anastasia Brow Pomade in the shade Ebony to fill them in. Then I'm going to go in with my NYS Control Freak Eyebrow Drill. Then I'm going to use my MAC Hold On Wear Concealer in the shade NW40 to conceal around my brows. use that same concealer as a base for my eyeshadow then I'm gonna go in with a finishing powder just to set this base um it doesn't matter which finishing powder you use I'm using my Sasha Buttercup baking cream Sasha Buttercup baking powder my eyeshadow first I'm gonna dip into the shade access from my Morphe Jaclyn Hill on the gorgeous palette and with my Morphe M441 brush I'm gonna apply this all over my crease area Residual damage left in place of what was beautiful. Excuse us, only work when what we've done is still excusable. We let the truth unfold, but still cheers to be now we're gonna dip into the shade Sparks from my Morphe Jaclyn Hill Bling Boss palette. And with my same Morphe M441 brush, I'm gonna apply it to like the middle area of my crease. I still want to show that yellow transition color, so it's you know, pretty much under there. <laughs> and when I walked away, I left footsteps in the mud so you could follow me. Yeah, so Betty holding water slips right through your fingers. We both end up drowning. It would hit the ground and in the path would wash away. Wash away. Now going back to my armed and gorgeous palette, I'm going to pick up the shade Prowl and apply this to the lower crease area. Um, I'm using the same M441 brush as well. As if you didn't have anything that you went through, I treated you like medicine. But I guess I wasn't listening. You tried to explain that you had hurt and pain too, but as long as I felt better then, it was all good. Now with my LA Colors Pro Conceal in the shade Porcelain, I'm going to cut my crease across my whole lid. Still dealing with the battles, feeling so inadequate. And I know that I should have stayed, but at the time it felt like I had to quit. And I know that you probably think I'm just out here thinking about myself, but you're still playing in my head to this day. Talking about you could have held, uh, but still cheers to be honest. Uh, neither of us knew what we wanted, no. but all we knew is that we cared. Now I'm going back in with the shade Prowl and applying this to the outer portion of my lid. Then I'm going to go back in with my Morphe M441 brush and just kind of blend everything together. Now for my main lid shade, I'm going to the shade VIP for my Arm de Gorgeous palette. I'm just applying this to the part where I cut my crease area. Patience could have done as well, cause I could tell that all we lack now for my eyeliner, I'm using my NYX Matte Liner, and all I'm doing is a classical winged liner. Neither of us knew what we wanted, but all we knew is that we cared. Still how we painted was a moment. when I walked away, I left footsteps in the mud so you could follow me. Steps in the mud. 
Now, unfortunately, I forgot to show you guys what the box looked like in my original recording, but the eyelashes I'm using in this one of Beauty Supply, they are called Our Soul Faux Mink Lashes and number six. Wash away. Now we're finally going to move on to my face. First to prime, I'm going to go in with my Fenty Primer. Then I'm going to spray with my MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plus Setting Spray. And then to conceal those dark spots, I'm going to go in with my Pro Conceal in the shade Orange. The foundation I'm using is by Fenty in the shade 440. Then to set that foundation, I want to go back in with my MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plus Setting Spray. I was caught up in a blessing. Didn't realize to highlight, I'm going to use my same MAC Polo Wear concealer that I used in the beginning in the shade NW40. You didn't have anything that you went through. I treated you like medicine. But I guess I wasn't listening. When you tried to explain that you had hurt and pain too. But as long as I felt better then, it was all good. We wasn't good So convinced that things were understood Meanwhile I had baggage to unpack And I just had to admit that Yeah Still dealing with the battles feeling so inadequate And I know that I should have stayed But at the time it felt like I had to quit And I know that you probably think I'm just out here thinking about myself But you're still playing in my head to this day talking about You could have helped But still choose to be honest to contour, I'm of course using my Fenty Mesh Stick in the shade Espresso. Going back in with my MAC concealer just to shape up that contour and make it kind of a nicer finish. Then I'm going to go back in with my foundation brush and I'm going to kind of tone down that contour look to give it a softer kind of outcome. Now to set everywhere I highlight it, I'm going in with my Ben Nye Topaz Luxury Powder. For my waterline, I'm first going to go back in with the shade Sparks with a medium brush. Then I'm going to go back in with the shade Prowl with a smaller blending brush. These brushes I got from the beauty supply, so they're kind of generic, but any blending brush for the eye will do. 
Now for my liner, I want to do a white liner, so I'm going in with my NYX white liner. It has no specific name, but it's just white liner. Yeah, so bad it holding water Slips right through your fingers We both end up drowning It would hit the ground And the path would wash away Wash away You are a vision of perfection In my eyes I was caught up in a blessing Didn't realize how it wasn't fair To compare all the things I knew that I've been through as if you didn't have anything that you went through I treated you like medicine But I guess I wasn't listening When you tried to explain that You had hurt and pain too But as long as I felt better then It was all good, but we wasn't good Now to finally set everything I'm going in with my Cover FX Illuminating Setting Spray I like this more than the MAC Press and Pine Fix Plus just because it kind of lets everything sit into my skin. Now I'm going to bronze with my Smashbox Contour Palette with the Terracotta Bronze. I wanted to do a blush originally, but I felt like the bronzer would give it a warmer look. Now we're finally getting to my lips. The um, liner I'm using is dark brown. I got this from the Nude Supply too, so any dark liner for the lips will do. The lipstick I'm using is by Sephora, Car Rouge I Love. And then I'm going in with my MAC Mineralized Glass Tender Lip Gloss. Now to highlight, I'm going into my Fenty Freestyler Highlighter Palette, and I'm picking up the shade Chills. You could have helped, but it is to be night. Neither of us knew what we wanted. All right, guys, this is for this makeup tutorial. If you like this video and if you like this look, please subscribe to my channel and please like my video. Thank you.